So in this video, we're gonna go over the hand shoe CT meter option that we've got to turn your hand shoe hybrid into a hand shoe AC retrofit controller. So let's go over all the components, how it all goes together, and how to activate the settings in the background to turn the hand shoe hybrid into an AC controller. So what you're gonna get is you're gonna get a chint box and inside that chint box you are gonna have the CT meter itself. That just needs an AC supply to it. So it's not a meter that goes in the consumer unit or where you have to cut the main tails to feed anything through it. That just needs an AC supply. And you're gonna get two CT clamps, one for the grid supply, so that's the main tail between the main fuse cutout and the meter of the property. And the other CT clamp is gonna go around a live cable, not the whole cable, but a live cable of the PV system, so you can now monitor the PV. So as you can see here, we've already pre-assembled one here, just to show you what it looks like when it's done. So obviously you can use your own enclosure box, they're not included. Uh, it doesn't need to be as big as that, it's just only one that we had around at the time. So as you can see, we've provided an AC supply to the meter. The two CT clamps are also wired, so they go into the, to the top of the meter here. It is upside down, but I just wanted to show you for the purpose of the video, this is the top of the meter where your live and neutral feed comes in and your CT clamps. So as you can see at the top of the meter there, you have the live and neutral feed and it's where the two CT clamps go. So you'll see that there's got a little small green connector block and what you have to the right hand side of that connector block, if you're looking at it straight on, that is where your PV one goes. The PV one goes here. And the other side is where your grid connection one goes. So at the bottom of the meter, that's where we stick our comms cable. So this comms cable comes from the meter back to the hand shoe inverter. As you can see, it's a little small green block which only takes two cables. And for the purpose of this video, we've used some Cat5 and we have used the orange and orange and white. At the other end, you want to crimp your RJ45 connector using ports one and two. Then that gets plugged into the bottom of the inverter, which is highlighted meter. So now that you've done that and you've wired up your meter CT and plugged everything into your hand shoe inverter, CT clamps are all located in the right place. You now need to move on to the monitoring and just change one setting. So in devices and under settings, you will see AC coupling. Just make sure that's enabled, which now allows the hand shoe hybrid inverter to now be used as an AC retrofit controller. And that's it. That's how you install the CT clamp to turn your hybrid into an AC unit.